Yeah, bounce through the gap. Yeah, look how quickly that goes across the surface. Yeah, sheer pace is not going to work on a track like this. It is straight and shiny, glossy, and if you provide the left-hander with any kind of width, it's going to put you away. Yeah, very sweet timer of the ball, Fakhar Zaman. Like betting here. Yeah? Yeah, it's certainly nice to get that early boundary away. You want to try and get that in the first couple of overs. Try and key factor, and if they get off to a good start here, then Kalandas, who have messed up the middle order so many times and seem to be learning now in the last two matches, they've held the, the innings together in the middle overs, can dent the opposition quite badly here. Well, he's forced that, but he's muscled it beautifully through the gap. He had to wait for it. Yeah, it's such a slow pitch that your off cutter has got to be properly lined up from a bowling point perspective. It was a half tracker, didn't have anything on it. Yeah, neither the the off spin or the leg spin or the, the slackening of the pace. It just set up very nicely for him to go hard and clean and nice. Oh, it's gone high. It's going to fall in the gap and bounce away. It's actually nearly carried all the way. Such was the pace of that delivery. And without a fine leg, I'm not too sure. I mean, we've seen a lot of those catches in the deep, haven't we, of these deliveries. Batsman getting hurried up, but Fakar gets away with that. In the end, it's not a bad shot. Didn't quite intend to hit it there. Just at the top part of the bat. When flying, the wide fine leg. Yeah, he knows it. A little bit lucky with that shot, but he gets the outcome. Zaman. Oh, he's gone through the hands. It went a pace. It had to be total reflex. It got to him quickly, but it did go straight to him. It's the end of the four. 31 for no loss. Zaman. Zaman's in. Oh, there's a pickup and flick of note. That is serious from Fakir Zaman. When he gets his range, when he gets his eye in, he's as dangerous as anyone who's playing this game. And that is typical of the unorthodox way he plays. He looks a bit ungainly sometimes, but that is magnificent. Yeah, Rahatali, don't go there. Sir Franz, look at him. Down the leg side to Fakhar Zaman. Not happy. Was that Urdu? Yes, it was. Thank you. Just uh, clarifying that. That's a bit of line and length. Oh, skates on. Have you got the sprigs at the back, young man? 50 has been posted in the meantime for the loss of Devsic. So looking forward to seeing him. Don't see much of him at all. Power play bears overall. Kalandas are the experts on power play. They really always get off to a flyer. Fakhar Zaman's just finding his range, backing away, using that short length. They strayed a bit on that leg side and been picked up through the leg. Yes, familiar faces and a familiar stroke from Fakhar Zaman. It brings up a boundary to third man quickly. Yeah, familiar bat speed. With those wrists of his, the bat really moves at speed. So anything off the edge, anything with a bit of width on the offside is going to fly away. No chance for third man. Well, I think with these boundaries here, your third man has got to be finer. I think he's got to be 5, 10 yards finer than normal. Now, Shane Watson is in... There you go, Fakhar Zaman this time floated up a little, too full, and we know he can do this. Pretty flat, but all the way. It's racing towards a half century here. 46 from 29, he just clears the front hip, gets that left leg out the way and right leg out the way, opens up a bit more with that front leg, and it disappears rather sweetly. Goes big into the gap, that's six. 
Magnificent stuff from the left-hander. Well, clear intent being shown here from Fucker Zaman. And he knows that he has a lot of responsibility with the bat for his team if they are to get a very good total. That was a slower delivery. He picked it nicely. And we've seen a shot like this before from him off the spinner. Gets another maximum. The fourth in the inning so far. Exactly what Lahore would want at this stage. Nine fours and four sixes in the innings. Oh, yeah, ten fours yeah. and four sixes. It's brilliant, isn't it? He's the man, isn't he? And this is uh, the face of the game. Gang, you've watched from afar. You've been following it. And this is where Lahore have failed time and time again. They've got a couple of totals of 160. But this is where the free spirit of them knowing they're not going to be in the top four, the fact he's going, He's the man now to take them deep into the innings and try and elevate it to at least 160, maybe even 170. I think this is a great thing about uh, PSL. This is what Pakistan cricket stands for. The excitement, the rawness yeah. of talent and seeing that unearthen in this competition is exactly what this tournament is all yeah, about. We've seen him on the international stage. This is just a representation, I always say. It's very similar to West Indian cricket, the flair, the mm. style, Fakhar yeah. Zaman, he's got it all the way. He's got to challenge himself. He's only had one previous T20 century. Can he get another one? That would be important. Yeah, no, he's a terrific player and he's just getting better. I was talking earlier on in the innings, both the openers have an unusual style, but he can reveal the stump sometimes, he's got his own way of hitting, but then he's got the technicality to play really good cricket shots as well. But he's, there's, there's just an ability to hit, and hit hard and long. And because he's got this, the skills really to attack a spinner, that makes him so much more a batsman. That's gone. Inside edge. Another boundary. A worrisome surprise walks up to his young apprentice. This is not working for Kalan, uh, for the Gladiators. How many runs in this over? 14 so far. And it's 100 up too. So it's come up at a rate of 8 runs and over. And they are 10 runs and over from here. And they've got 7 wickets in the bank. I think they should be looking at trying to get that 170 at least. Yeah, the last 4 was uh, producing 39 runs. Yeah. So it's been a really good bit of pace on the ball. On the bat. Shot ball, that's gone. We'll hit the fence in no time. This is good batting, adjusted beautifully. The one thing I like about him, he doesn't really commit himself or he doesn't premeditate at all when he bats. He's an instinctive type player. If you look at him, he moves very late. Gives a little bit of a shimmy and then makes up his mind and commits it. Yeah, and the over adjustment there from Watson, he saw him go early, tried to adjust it to his body. But it's almost played in Fakas. It'll be after the next over. That's gone up in the air. Will this be taken? 65 meter fence. Well, it was a good effort. Jason Roy there doing few acrobatics. And I think he saved a six. Yeah, it'd be interesting. Well. It was all, he plumped it back over. Just be interesting whether he was touching anything when that happened. He, he sort of took it, got low, and then threw it back and uh, unsure at this day brilliant effort though it's something that has grown into the game we've seen fielders make it look so easy takes the catch gets it back into yeah. the field yeah. without conceding a maximum that's excellent work on the part of jason roy he's taking the beauty the too, isn't he? Rope. it's just where it lands does that ball land beyond it, it certainly does great effort great effort just off a flight, another one of these guys flown in. Bit of acrobatic work. I think it touched the boundary rope on the way back. So Do you think it did? Yes, yeah. it did, it did. Interesting, very interesting. We still wait. We want this to be a safe. Yeah, right. So he's done well here. What about yeah, yeah I think it did. just kissed just, the cushion. Just fence here. Just hit it on the way back over, didn't it? After all that great effort. Yeah. Six six. Yeah, so Ramiz, I mean Lahore is looking 
very much like they will break the record set by Islamabad United in yesterday's match. A record total set by them. 185 yeah, when yeah. they batted first. So if they carry on at the current rate, they'll get 172. Hello. Hi, Rummies. Hello, it, Rummies. Hello. Hello, Rummies. <laughs> and we get the honor to be next to you. <laughs> ah, it's it's, it's a okay. Great man. A great man. Yeah. It's an honor to be next sit <laughs> sitting next to you too, Pat. Oh, oh yeah. beautiful. Six straight, strong hit. We haven't seen a hundred in the PSL yet. Well, we haven't, I don't want to put the mocha on him. <laughs> we have not seen it. Some clean hitting from Fakar Zaman. In the slot, head down. Ah, oh, maximum, what a shot. Power. Look, Look at this strike rate. from the man. 182.2 is the strike rate. He's increasing the knots. Yeah. Here's a lift. Mm. Oh! in no time what a what a bashing phenomenal shot that is baseball babe ruth i was going to parallel that to like a federer yeah yeah, yeah. And the power from this man he gets better and better as his innings progresses wow oh, that's muscle that really was muscle well, it is. He, he, I mean, that's just a phenomenal shot over long off in that position. Again, you see that hitting base of front leg away and just gives you that art. But that is an L3. Oh, that's all oh, cover. Is it going all the yeah. way? Uh, it just trickles and hits the fence, but what an over. 24 runs of the over Kalandas 140 for the loss of three Fakhar Zaman 94 49 and we it's gone big man underneath it gone Hassan Khan takes the catch at long off and there won't be a hundred from Fakhar Zaman tonight